Good morning. What day is it today? It's Thursday. It's crack day today. I'm going to get cracked. I'm going to get cracked. Uh, crunch. Uh, uh, uh. And that's just me. But yeah, I'm going to get cracked today. Cracked and crunched and popped and things, hopefully. And, you know, to make hopefully posture a bit better and stuff. Um, yeah, so that should be fun. You're coming with me, but I'm afraid I'm not paying for your treatment, sorry. I don't think it's that expensive though. It's um it's forty pounds and I, for some reason I was expecting it to be way more. At least I think it's forty pounds. That's what it said on the desk anyway. It was consultation was sixty five, um, but I had a twenty five pounds off for going through Instagram. So, that, so consultation was £40 and then I'm sure it said treatment £40. So I'm quite happy to pay that, um, you know, to to get things not so stiff in the back, you know, just to feel a bit better. So we shall see how that goes. Um, I'm guessing with something like that, it's probably good to have like regular sessions. So maybe like do a once a month thing, you know, that could be good. We shall see. We shall see. I mean, if it if it helps, you know, quality of life and everything, I think it's I think it's worth it. And what I have done is I let my membership lapse at the nice hotel swimming pool thing, um, which I'm a bit like, ah, oh, like that is a real shame. But. Like, since we moved here, and I know it's such a lame excuse, like that extra, you know, five minutes walk, um, and the bus price is going up. We just weren't doing it. And so, if I want to go swim, the wreck is just there, if I want to go swim. So, and it's like four pound a session or something. So yeah i wish i could just go go to my hotel and pay four pound a session but they don't do that unfortunately i wish they did because then i would not feel so bad i would like the option but there we are i will miss my pool although to be fair it was getting uh, a bit like like mr splashy was always in there and he's quite annoying and and the woman that always likes talking and um and because they still haven't fixed the jacuzzi anyone that's there on a spa day just kind of floats around in the pool and gets in your way um anyways i've got five things going out on ebay today there were some Etsy orders as well but i've already packaged them and they are off off um so I've had, uh, there was two late last night, two orders late last night, and then three come in this morning, which is quite nice. So it's always nice to get out of bed and go like, ah, I've already made like some money. That's, that's quite nice, you know, considering I'm going to spend 40 pounds of it straight away. And another five pounds 60 on bus fare and probably will have a coffee there. So, you know, um, I have got a whatnot show tonight. I am waiting on a delivery of jewellery though. So I put it down as I, I've got, um, so I'm doing, um, it's called dopamine dressing where you wear like, you know, cutesy stuff and fab colours and big bold things and stuff like that. But I'm wondering whether to save that because I've got a delivery of jewellery. Like I'll take a look at it and if it looks like it might just be pap, um, which sometimes it is, it's very hit or miss. Then, um, then I'll carry on with the dopamine show, which I haven't really prepped for. I put some stuff aside, but I need to dig out some more. Um, but if like the delivery looks okay, then I'll do mystery jewelry and bagging. So we'll see later. It probably won't be delivered until like five o'clock now, and I'll be like, shit. Shows at seven though tonight, so hopefully we'll be okay. Right, I'll go grab my orders and show you what's going out.
Okay, so this is what's going out. We have got a Tank Link bracelet by Revo. Always popular, these Tank Link ones. So nice. Or oh, Panther. Um, and that's over £14.39. An Oscar de la Renta necklace. Um, so all designer, but it is broken. There's like stones and bits missing and stuff. So I put it, it is with faults. Um, so that's how come it's sold for only £27.99. It would have been more around the £50 to £60 market, but it'd be perfect. Um, a Pandora little keychain that went for £11.99. A peace of mind carved uh, gemstone beaded necklace went for £4. I've got four left of those now. And then this little, well, I say little, actually it's quite chunky. Uh, necklace with a heart charm and toggle clasp and that went for $7.99 so pretty easy uh, packaging to do today hello you what are you whinging about now because it's wet outside you can't go and play and you come to dry yourself off on the on my bed you can see you have been out you do a little damp cat I'm sorry, no playtime. Oh. You're my pretty girly. No. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> oh, look at it out there. Proper raining. Umbrella up. Time to go get on the bus. I hate having an umbrella. It's so annoying. I'm bound to lose it today. It's the 8th of August. Ridiculous. Went right to my MP. Okay, here we are in Cowbridge. Just to prove it. Um, right, my sort of plan is chiropractor and happy days vintage place so, because I don't think I've been in there for a little while um, and then probably not the charity shops probably just a relaxing coffee somewhere and then bus home so off we go wish me luck okay I'm out <laughs> that was awesome like not as many pops and cracks as they could have been um, because parts of my body are still you know very tense and stuff but I definitely had a few like ah oh, really good ones that were less um she brought out this like massage gun thing which looks a bit like it might have dual uses um and she did that like all over my back and my shoulders and my bum and um and like right in like the shoulders and stuff oh my god <sighs> Painful at times, the pain can be good. And then at other times I was like, oh, that was amazing. Oh, I'm gonna go through the gardens. Um, yeah, so that was totally lush. So I'm booked in for more. So I'm gonna have two more next week. Um, and yeah, so we've got a whole treatment program going on gonna be lush anyway so I'm going through the physic gardens I should really show you because it's really nice so that's where we've come from there's like a little almost like an orangery type thing with a little pool with lily pads look look at all the fishies sorry I've got an out for you mate isn't that cool And then a nice little park with benches. And then through here is the physic garden. My mum likes to come here on a Thursday because there's the people that look after the physic garden sometimes sell um, like um, little starter plants and things, which is quite nice. Da, da, da. Of course, it's a lot nicer when it's not raining, but it's still a pretty garden. 
This isn't it yet, by the way. This is the pre-garden. Isn't that all lovely? And here we go. This is the physic garden. So they keep examples of lots of plants here. And they look after them. It's like a voluntary thing. Isn't it lush? Then there's a little folly over there. That's a nice place to have a little picnic over there. That's where, oh yeah, look, they're selling the plants now, actually. See, there you go. But I'm not sure whether mum wants anything. She likes coming up here and picking them herself anyway. Look, they are having a picnic with their little doglet. Isn't it nice? Right. Anyways, I think I am going to head out. Which I think is that the way. And I am going to go to Happy Days. And it smells absolutely fantastic down here. It's got all the lavender. And then all the apples. It just smells so good. Ah. <sighs> Anyways, happy days. Yay, dog friendly tea room. Should really borrow a dog. Cock. Bear. Kitty. Pretty trio, five pounds. Bet my sister's got all of those. She'll have all of these. The sale items, three pound a trio.
like this shelf because it could be anything on there. Little piano playing. Oh, yeah. Old fashioned. And a, and a foot joint. Weird. Lots of records from ABC to CZ Top. The vintage clothes, including a delightful Jaeger. Oof. Always oh, handsome. Postcards 10p. Stool stool, ah, I get it. Genius, genius. And then this is the tea room which they've done out. But there's nothing here for me to eat, so I am gonna go and get a coffee somewhere. Oh, duck. One Americano, cream on the side. You beauty. Just waiting for the bus. Where's my umbrella? It's in my bag. Don't worry. Right. I'm gonna get on the bus, but you guys can take the shortcut. We haven't done this for a while. We Back home. Time for some lunch. One bacon and tomato salad for lunch. With a bit of sour cream. Hello, it's a few hours later. I'm starting to ache a bit now. And she said that would happen. Um but still, my back definitely feels a lot better. Can't wait for the next sesh. Anyway, what I've been doing is that behind me and that is setting up for tonight's whatnot. So I've gone for basically just like things that like that spark joy in me anyway, things that kind of made me go like, ah, and stuff. And some pretty things and some weird things and some kooky things. So um, Snoopy there and then a very 90s ring and something that's made from an acorn and some babushkas and um uh, the whale whale things um beautiful sterling silver necklace there and um, one of those like jangly things and some gemstones and a bit of brutalism and some fruit and a very nice weird bit of silver in there so this is going to be my show tonight so i best get editing this together and have a bit of a sit down and stuff. And then in a bit, I shall have some dinner, which will be exciting leftovers from yesterday. Whoop, whoop. Um, although I am actually quite excited about it because um, it is chilly and I love chilli. So I'll do some chilli and cauliflower rice. Yum, yum. Kitten, have you been busy today? Have you been busy kittening? Yeah? Good girl. So um, we're going to say goodbye now, okay? Because I've got to edit this together and get prepped and everything and, you know, snuggle cats. So, bye-bye now. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye. Oh, you're rubbish.